What is blepharitis? Anything with a name like blepharitis has got to be unpleasant, right? Well, if your eyes are red, burny and itchy, you may have blepharitis. And I don't have to tell you how uncomfortable that can be. Blepharitis occurs when glands located in the eyelids get blocked and can't produce enough oil to lubricate your eyes. These glands are called meibomian glands, and when they aren't working properly, your eyes, and you, get irritated. Your skin type, environment, allergies, age, and diet all play a role in blepharitis. The bad news is that blepharitis is a chronic condition that never completely goes away. So what to do about it? You can control it so that it bothers you less and less. Here's how. Let's start with some simple things. A warm compress is very helpful and even feels good. Try this. Take a washcloth and run it under very warm water. Apply it to the closed eyelids with gentle pressure for at least five minutes. Lid scrubs can also give you some relief. After using the warm compress, use a mild cleanser, either as a medicated pad or foam on the fingertip, and gently scrub back and forth along the lid margins, where the eyelashes come out, with the eyes closed. These cleansers are specifically formulated for the eyes and do not need to be rinsed off. Sometimes, prescription eye drops can help. Your doctor may also prescribe a medication to use along the lid margins after the lid scrubs. Again, do this with the eyes closed, but don't worry if it gets in the eye. So there it is, three things that can help your eyes feel better, and they can help keep your blepharitis under control. Some other things you can do to make your eyes feel better include using artificial tears containing an oil component, increasing the omega-3 in your diet, and remembering to blink more often when reading or using the computer. If all of these things still don't offer relief, there are two new treatments available that can. Lipiflow Thermal Pulsation and IPL, Intense Pulsed Light Therapy. But let's try the simple things first. Hopefully these suggestions will help you to live and see more comfortably. If you have any questions, please give us a call or visit our website.